Kanji is a security platform for companies that primarily use Apple products, and lately it's become quite popular. But what are its main features and how does it work exactly? Let's find out. Hey Project Managers, I'm Meredith and in this video we're going to be taking a look at Kanji, a mobile device management and security platform for Apple products like Mac computers, iPhones, and iPads. Kanji co-founders Adam Pettit, Mark Daughters, and Wesley Pettit said they saw a need for mobile device management, or MDM for short, for organizations that primarily use Apple products, especially because other existing solutions were either too simple or too complex. So Kanji was created in 2018 to meet the growing needs for modern businesses. So it's safe to say a lot of companies could use the extra support that Kanji provides. But what is Kanji actually capable of? Let's take a closer look at this MDM platform. Also, if you have any experience with Kanji, tell me about it in the comment section below. Kanji includes a lot of features, such as one-click automation, custom scripts, and many app integrations. Configuring profiles to manage a range of devices and user needs is also available, which is great if you need to manage devices for users with unique permissions. There's also remote device encryption enforcement, lock slash wipe capabilities, lock bypass codes, and access to file vault recovery keys and lock passwords. If you need more help, there are auto apps to help ensure users are always using the right version of every application. All updates are thoroughly tested across the operating systems and hardware with enforcement options, notification management, configuration profiles, and delivery options. Kanji also has integrations for popular productivity apps like Slack, Google Workspace, and Microsoft 365. Passport is at the heart of Kanji's security system. It extends a user's company-issued single sign-on, or SSO, credentials to Mac computers. Passport also supports leading password managers such as Okta, Azure, OneLogin, and other platforms that use OpenID authentication for password syncing. With these features combined, users can always log in with their most up-to-date credentials, causing less headaches for IT support. Kanji also has multiple security templates. Each one is customizable for specific business compliance needs and are easily deployable in minutes. Plus, these templates allow users to be notified of upcoming deadlines to update or upgrade applications installed on their device. And for extra support, a Kanji agent resides in every device. It keeps records of all configurations and automatically remediates unapproved changes to the device's software. The onboarding process is seamless on Kanji thanks to Liftoff, an automated setup that transforms a newly unboxed Mac computer into an enterprise-ready workstation. It allows one to install all the company's pre-approved apps, settings, and security clearances as soon as the user powers on the device for the first time. This MDM software also has a robust error handling and recovery system, such as addressing low battery or disconnected Wi-Fi situations during the initial setup. Admins can immediately customize the screen too, informing users when their device is ready for use and properly configured. The clean interface displays and setup process allows users to configure their device by themselves without direct involvement from IT. But if users do need an extra hand, Kanji's self-service, help links, and online resources can be made readily available. Now on paper, the asking price for full access to Kanji's platform can be quite daunting. The price depends on how many Apple devices your company uses. Currently, one could have a plan ranging from $400 up to $9,000 per month. Of course, the price could change after having a conversation with the Kanji sales team if your business doesn't meet the less than 100 devices or is more than 3,000. But if you want to try Kanji before committing to the cost, they offer new users a 14-day free trial. After exploring Kanji, there's no doubt that this is a great solution to help you automatically manage devices and security. Of course, if your company uses Android and Windows devices, you'll have to search for another platform because Kanji is only compatible with Apple products. Check out Technology Advice for the latest software overview videos if you're looking for an alternative. Or if you want to give Kanji a try, click the link in the description below for a 14-day free trial. Also, if you found this video helpful, be sure to click the like icon and hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up with all things project management. Thanks for watching. Bye.